to really understand the love of God and to kind of be, um, just to be interactive with that um, in a radical way, I think is what drew me to God and is what continually draws me to God, is just how loving he is and how he relentlessly comes after us. I think seeing the transformative power of God's grace in my life um, and also his purpose. Um, just seeing people who may have infuriated me before, just looking at them as just broken messes and seeing humanity in places I didn't expect um, was just amazing to experience. I think there was a, a color and a depth in life that I was just missing before. I love that God, like first and foremost, like loves me um, without any stipulations and without any conditions. Um, there's nothing that I can do um, to make him stop loving me, um, which is something that like I've struggled with in relationships like my whole life. It's like what you know, like some I'm gonna do something and like then they're gonna like stop loving me and like leave me. Um, so I, I think like first and foremost, that's like the biggest thing is like you know God, like I can do like you know really anything and He's still gonna call me His child and like call call me back to Him every single time regardless of what I do. I really love the faithfulness of God and. Even though I am a human and I'm a sinner and I can constantly mess up and do things that I just wish I wouldn't do, I know that even in spite of those things, God will always forgive and he's always there. And I'm never not enough um, because he loves me as I am. And so I think that the faithfulness of God is what constantly draws me back to him and is what makes me want to be faithful to him um, just because he is always so faithful to me not defining myself by my failures, but like looking at God and God saying like, no, like you are not your failures. You are like who I've created you to be. For each and every day, I know that no matter what happens, like I have a God who loves me and I have a God who gives me a purpose. And no matter what life throws my way, that at the end of the day, it's just he and I, and it'll be that way forever. I think that God's hope has given me hope, not only in the days right now, but also for the days ahead too.